Hey guys, just a quick tutorial here. So we are creating a Niagara smoke system right now. And uh, in this tutorial, we're going to be explaining how you can make something go and interact with this one. So we've come here, created our first Niagara system. If you don't know, um, you need to uh, go to the edit plugins and then type in fluids and make sure this one's turned on Niagara fluids this is really important without it it just wouldn't work because there's nothing inside the plugins folders and then you can just go ahead and right click Niagara system create a system based on a template or a behavior example and then these are uh, 2d gases and liquids what I've come to um, use right now is a 3d gas which is this one 3d gas wire you can go ahead and probably use a smoke, which let's actually could go ahead and do that. Now we have to wait for the compilation of shaders. Okay, in the meanwhile, while that is um, compiling shaders, so if you go ahead and create, um, not like that actually, uh, create a Bit simple cube right now and if you want to just use it in your scene it just wouldn't work the fire or the smoke or the fluid will just go through the cube or the mesh that you have uh, brought to the scene and based on what Unreal Engine developers are saying this is del deliberate because they didn't want us to randomly place a fire or a smoke into our scene and it must it might happen that the scene is really complicated and everything just crashes so they, they didn't want that so this doesn't work how can we make it work so come in here in the details panel type in tag in the advanced section hit the plus icon and then come here type in collider and bam it works just like that it's actually so easy to make it work as if it was already working but wasn't showing anything and it looks nice so if you want to uh, for example the fire is really small and you want to make it bigger by the way I'm using the default resolution you can crank it up and it just doesn't really work as real time for me it's just so laggy so I might go ahead with something like 64 as well but just to make sure it's fluid enough um, and the world space size you can change the size as well if you want it to go really really big and be aware that if you are making this bigger the resolution goes down you have to crank up the resolution which in the end will uh, have a very very intense performance cost so keep that in mind um, and uh, we have created this one let's see how that one works So it's starting from here. Oh, never mind. So we have already created our cube here. It is interacting with everything. Let's delete our fire. And now it just interacts with our smoke in a way that it's so beautiful. Look at that. Yeah, that's it. Enough of playing. That's it. I hope it helped you guys. And if it did help, please hit that like button. Cheers.